Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So we have a brand new build in the Canary Channel, build 26212, which Microsoft rolled out on the 8th of May. And for this week, they are mainly focusing on changes and improvements for Windows Share. And then we also get two important fixes uh, for the File Explorer if you do find yourselves in the Canary Channel testing new features uh, in that early preview version. Now, first of all, focusing on Windows Share, and the first is Microsoft says you are now able to generate QR codes for URLs and cloud file links through the Windows Share window to share pages and files across devices. And as many of you may well know, you can already send a link to your phone from the Share dialog if you have phone link installed and set up. But obviously with a QR code, it doesn't require any initial setup or login. So um, you don't actually need phone link installed for this. So this is actually a nice move uh, in the right direction. And then they also say that clicking outside the Windows Share window uh, will no longer close it. So to close the Windows Share window, you just press the close button at the top right corner. So um, I think that's another little improvement as well. And then the last uh, improvement rolling out for Windows Share is if your Microsoft account uses a Gmail address, uh, you can now send email to yourself from Windows Share window and receive it in your Gmail account. And I actually also think that's another little nice step in the right direction. So that's all to do with Windows Share. And then just focusing on uh, those two fixes for the File Explorer. I mean, we get fixes for known issues. We get two general uh, Copilot in Windows, Taskbar and System Tray. But these have been quite uh, important bugs that have been causing a couple of headaches uh, for the Canary Channel. And the first is they fixed an issue which was causing File Explorer to sporadically crash when using path suggestions in the address bar. And then the second uh, fix is they fixed an issue which could cause File Explorer to crash sometimes when going from the search box to the body of File Explorer and that could cause the File Explorer to crash. So those are two important fixes if you do find yourself in the Canary channel. And then just a quick reminder regarding the Canary channel, because it's very early days. Microsoft says uh, the builds they released to the Canary channel should not be seen as matched to any specific release of Windows and features and experiences included in these builds may never get released um, as they try out different concepts and get feedback. So always remember that when we talk about new features in the Canary channel. And that also applies to uh, Microsoft Edge Canary or Chrome Canary as an example, which are still very early days. And then obviously that also applies to the Canary channel when it comes to the Windows 11 Insider program. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.